And I know another part of our strategy is for us to make sure that power of 12 small groups yeah. are really moving forward. I have an incredible story this week in a power of 12 that I attend. We actually had a new believer come in and say, what can I do to be baptized tonight? Wow. And so on Wednesday night, after our Wednesday night service, which was out of this world, we actually baptized someone for the first wow. time uh, in her life. And it was just wonderful. And I'm, we're gonna see that. And I, that was a picture, I believe, right. of what God's gonna begin to do in our Power of 12. So tell us, Pastor, what you're expecting and what you're seeing happen in our Power of 12 groups as we move forward. You know, the Power of 12, is, why is that so important? And you say, what's a Power of 12? All it is is a small group of two or more people that meet together together on a, re a weekly basis and this is what we do we serve one another we care for one another we go through a bible study together and this is a place that we grow together care for one another and also grow as leaders taking responsibility you know we have a responsibility not just to know christ but to share christ and jesus said this, this is what he said he said this he goes if you love me do you love me peter he asked peter do you love me he says take care of my sheep. What are you saying? How we show Jesus we love him is by taking care of one another. And we don't want anybody to be lonely. We don't want anybody left out because there's so many of us that are struggling in this season. And one of the most dangerous things you can do when you're struggling is this, be all alone. And we wanna make sure no one is left out. So what we're gonna do every week, we're gonna watch online one of the services on nine o'clock, 11 o'clock, one o'clock, or or maybe all of them, Wednesday night as well. We're gonna have our same exact schedule. You're gonna tune in to a live live broadcast. The next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna make sure that you're joined into a Power 12, that you have a small group that you're meeting with on a regular basis so you can pray for one another, care for one another, and make sure that all the needs are met. The reality is there's gonna be some people that lose their jobs in this season. And what are we gonna do? We're gonna make sure as a church community that we take care of one another, make sure the food is there, the family doesn't have to have any extra stress. And if you did lose your job, I really believe this, God's gonna give you a better job. Thank God for closed doors because God's opening bigger doors. Our responsibility is to continue being the church. We are not intimidated by the situation because greater is he that's in us than whatever we're facing in this world. This is what we're going to do. We're going to continue proclaiming the good news of Jesus Christ. People are looking to see how we react. God's given us a plan, and his plan leads to success, victory. We're going to be better off than when we started this trial. 9 o'clock in the morning live, 11 o'clock live, 1 o'clock live, Wednesday night live. See you there at your personal watch party. And a watch party is just a, a, a group of people coming together and watching the service live online. God bless you. We love you.